اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سبجیکٹ سوشل سٹیڈیز گریڈ سکس یونٹ نمبر فائف اکانومی لیسن نمبر ون دا انڈسٹریل ریولوشن پیج نمبر ون ہنڈرڈ اینڈ سکس لیسن ٹارگٹ سٹوڈنٹ ویل ریکوگنائز دا انڈسٹریل ریولوشن اینڈ اٹس افیکٹس آن ورلڈ وائڈ لیسن ابجیکٹو سٹوڈنٹ شوڈ بی ایبل ٹو نو فسٹ آئیڈینٹیفائی دا ریزنس بہائنڈ دا ریولوشن اینڈ لسٹ دا افیکٹس آف دا ریولوشن سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ ٹو ڈیز لیسن فسٹ آف آل دا انڈسٹریل ریولوشن از اے ریولوشن دیٹ اکرس ان دا فیلڈ آف انڈسٹری ویئر بائی مور مشینس گیٹ ٹو بی یوزڈ ٹو ریپلیس لیبر یو کین سی ہیئر بیفور اف یو گو پاسٹ ہیئر لاٹ آف people or labor do work but nowadays and due to industrial revolution we replaced in the place of labor machines and now robots it is not a revolution in which people fight one another but it is revolution in the way of doing things actually don't think that or don't misunderstand in the form of that people want to work and it's a fight between machines and people but actually they make the work more efficient more easy and more faster as compared to men or as compared to labor so they the way of doing the things the industrial revolution first started in england and moved on into all other countries so there are reasons behind the revolution so what will be the reasons political stability in europe less disease more crop were demand did population growth reached up to 100 so first when the people or labor do work that time they don't have enough capacity to produce or give the things that's the reason they need the machines to do more work or due to growth in population their demand will be more and it's uh, quite difficult that time to give the things as the people demand so they uh, introduce machines instead of labor and then they're going to fulfill the needs of the people economy had to cope with the needed of the needs of the people three fields were affected greatly number one is technological effects new raw material were used more energy resources were used factory system spread communication and transportation developed many machines replaced manpower so these first the technology how it's work and help us what happened when we use latest and new technology they give us new raw material for this thing and more energy resources we can use instead of just going to consumption of the uh, coal and gas and the manpower then also factory system spread you can see that lot of factory build and then they use the communication and transportation developed so in this way these things also give uh, you can say that increase in them and developed machines replaced manpower instead of working of the people we use machines thanks for